My name is Finn Forster, this is Billy Smith, and this is my song, Steer Right Till The End, live and acoustic from the Alvarez studio. <laughs> Wandering, all the blues, stumbling my way back, feeling down through the streets of T.S. Boy. Street lights shining so bright, I can only see silhouettes of you and me. It's right so. Timeless, feeble, taking everything I could. And everything there was, let's rise up, don't make up, break through all the noise that we can hear. When we Track number one is a song called Steer Right Till The End, um, which is predominantly, when we recorded it, played on sort of a, a mix of acoustic and electric. So it's, But it's been really, really nice to, to hear it stripped back acoustically, especially with these two guitars, um, and hear it, hear it acoustically with the, you know, what Billy would usually play on the electric. I think because, it, you know, it's, it's so warm sounding, you know, it's, it's really, really big sounds coming from these guitars. It's, um, it just naturally sounds, fits the song. Um, so it's been really cool stripping it back, playing it acoustically. But Steer Right Till The End um, is perfect for, for, for guitars like these because it's got huge choruses, um, really prolonged chords and stuff like that. And 
but I, I must I must say I'm a big fan of, uh, of of guitars with a lot of natural amplification. You don't really need to do much to hear it ring out and and stuff like that. And this from the off, um, this certainly was one of those guitars where from from a single strum you can you know you can hear it ring out. And I'll give it a it rings out for ages, which is always uh, one of my favourite things. I think about acoustic guitars it certainly is the. Uh, is what comes naturally with it before you've added anything, you know, just this is a whole package just from the office is, is a really beautiful sounding guitar. So I do have a, um, an Alvarez classical guitar at home and this is the first time I've played a Yairi um, FYM 66 HD. It's a beautiful guitar and what I like about this guitar is as a like a lead guitarist, I normally pick up a guitar and I'm doing like all the, all that lead stuff but I just want to just play like G and C all day. I'm like, simple, simple just sounds so nice. I love it. Resonates really nice. Sounds lovely. Don't you know you're wrong? I've never been out down before. And I can show you what's in store. One of these days Said it's been a long night, nearly broken to a fight But I've never been so surprised that I compromised so soon Cause it's just never been you And I've been spending all day thinking how I'll make you pay But I've never been a jealous type and never felt quite right to me Cause it's just never been me Don't you know you're wrong? It's been a long time since I used to call you mine But I've never been one for words It just feels absurd to me When I just want to be free I try to keep out of your way But you try to make me sway You keep asking if I be the same And it's such a shame it's done I kind of feel like I've won Cause Don't you know you're wrong I've never been out there Things that I've been through 
就是那样啊。I've never been that down before, and I can show you what's in store one of these days. So can't back down. My new single, my upcoming single, is um, probably the the outcome. Of like you know the the last three years uh, of uh, hard work and and kind of going on that journey of trying to find the you know my artistry who I am you know the and everything from the branding to the signature sound to you know what what we where we want to go down and then uh, I guess it's about uh, it's written from a place of uh, frustration actually and you know you'll hear it from the off it's it's got this aggression to it but then we've kind of made it into a a very kind of country. Sort of Americana influenced indie indie song, I guess. We've turned it into that. It's it yeah, it's it's written from a place of of, of frustration and things, but then we've made it. We've turned it into this powerful this powerful track. I think that you'll hear the the undertones of you know Billy's sort of cowboy riffs that we we've I've come to love and, and we've come to love creating and stuff. And kind of think about Tarantino, Tarantino a Tarantino film. There's a few Tarantino films, isn't there, that we we like to、uh, take influence from musically, which is a bit different, really, I guess, because a lot of the time artists will take influence from other artists, but we kind of went down the route of film scores.、Um, one of the big things I've realised as an artist is that journey of self-discovery on where you want to head to, and what road you you find yourself going down、uh, genre-wise, and and what and the music you're writing and, and coming up with, I think is can only be found. Through trial and error, and, and and a repeat process and consistency of doing it, and I think we've, especially me as an artist, I've found myself, you know, almost subconsciously just ending up with a lot of、uh, indie folk music. But it's got, considering we're from the northeast of the UK, it's got a lot of heavy country influence, and、um, yeah, I find myself kind of admiring the likes of Chris Stapleton, Luke Combs,、uh, Ray LaMontagne. I don't know whether that's just because I come from such an acoustic background, but and I just love the music in general. But、um, I think heading to that's where we're heading towards, especially、um, across the next sort of、uh, across the the course of this year as we're releasing releasing new music and we've finally found that that sort of sound. It's a lot of、uh, singer songwriter songs, a lot of storytelling within the songs, and a lot of country country elements to it. 